Well, hey folks, this is Seven here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Farm Sim 22. We're here on the Calm Lands map, of course. And first thing I'm going to do today, and for the first time so far, I'm going to go throw the front loader rig onto this. But not the uh, pallet fork they gave us. There we go. Now we need to go to the shop. We're going to buy a stone bucket. Possibly. We'll see. Alright. What a momento, Tractor. Let's get this other one busy. We're going to uh, hand it over to a hired worker to do some rolling for us. Yes. Rolling indeed. As you can see, I've fully maintained it, fueled her all up, so ready to go. Great little tractor, as was mentioned in the comments. Okay, we got a ways to go. I'm going to replace that, our uh, stone to crush air, with one that crushes stone and produces lime. It's available on the mod hub. Do -do -do -do. Uh, where have I left this thing? I think it's on the other side of the field. I've got our grass all done here, but it needs rolled. So we're going to get on that. Well, we're not going to get on that. We're going to uh, designate someone to get on that. What are the little sparkly bits on the top? Oh, there's screws in the top of uh, some type of a hatch. Interesting. They were really, uh, really catching the sunlight, I must say. Alright, so can I kind of set you loose here and assume you're not going to do anything too strange? Probably not, eh? Um. Okay, this doesn't say anything about rolling, so if I set you in the other direction. Yeah, I think that might be a slightly wiser choice. I've just noticed that uh, when I've used the AI here, not on this map in particular, but I noticed it on the other map, if you are going to end up having them get near a road or a building, rather than faff about so that they can actually get the end of the road that's near said road or building, they were basically just stopping 20 yards short and going, well, that's as close as I'm allowed to go. But, you know, uh, that isn't going to cut it. So, I'm thinking this way should work. Head on out there, dude. That's what I wanted to see. Let me get out of your way before you complain about having an object in your field. Yes, indeed. All right, now we can go back to the other tractor. Let him carry on. What I want to do, I actually uh, started a little earlier, and I replaced that stone crusher. Um, <laughs> and it didn't quite go as smoothly as I would have hoped. I mean, it placed down just fine. And fortunately, the cement pad on it is a little bit different shape than the one we have. And entirely for convenience, I dumped our piles of stone extremely close to said cement pad. When I put the new one down, all my stones were gone. Can't have that. There must be $20 worth. But more importantly, there's like thousands of dollars worth of lime. So, as I say, we are off to get the shovel. Now, I might need to throw them in a trailer, so we're probably going to need a trailer as well. That's okay. That's okay. How you doing to chickens? Make eggs. I know, you're too young. 
you shouldn't even be thinking about things like that. <laughs> Alright. Let's jump in here. And we're just gonna cut straight up across the fields and all that joy. As there is no traffic, we can sprint across the road like we own the place. Because, well, you know, we own the place. Alrighty. And there we go. Now, I haven't bought a bucket yet. So, we'll have to see what happens. We still got this guy sitting here. Funky Ting. Alright, now let's have a look at our options, shall we? Let's go to Wee Bits and Bobs and uh, Telehandler, Wheel Loader, Front Loader, 12s. So we have this bucket for $1,600. Carries 1,000 liters. We have this guy for fifteen thousand. What? What the heck? Oh, never mind. Uh, and it holds twenty three hundred liters. We got this guy for fourteen hundred that holds eighteen. Makes you look sad. And then we've got this. Now it holds twelve hundred liters. It's a beet basket and stone picker. Hmm. Now, it says it only holds those. These. Uh, yeah, this will take... So, yeah, we're way ahead to not get the stone picker. And to go with just a normal basquette. So, 1,800 liters, 1,200 liters. We're going to buy this guy. Details are... It's for sale. That's the kind of details I like. Yes, we're going to buy you. Okay. So Brody's having themselves a wonderful week. It should be pretty much the middle of the week, I guess, when this goes up. So, uh, yeah. If you made it this far, it's an easy one to the end. <laughs> he says, completely making it up as he goes along. If you're new to the channel, hey, if you haven't subscribed yet, maybe consider dropping a subscription. And, of course, don't forget, all he is, like that video. If you like the video, you know, then, yeah. Hit, hit the like. Let everybody know that I like that video. Don't worry, nobody ever looks. Alright, we've got El Bucket. So, off we go to our pile of stones. Might be a good time to bring our truck and trailer home. Now, we're going to need both of them. That's our only water trailer. But the truck one might be just handy enough to grab these stones. That was the idea of getting that, was to have something that would be very, very portable and hopefully quite quick to move between things like factories and uh, points of resource. So, Okay, we seem to be in a bit of a, oh, <laughs> a bit of an idiot that doesn't know how to use a bucket. There we go. Yoing. Now we're full. Oh. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. Alright, um, hmm. Oh, I see what I've done. Okay, uh, yeah. Wasn't thinking there, were we? Okay. That's probably not gonna be enough weight. Okay. I mean, it's better than what we were doing before. <laughs> Let's put all the weight in the front. And then grab a, a ton of stone and throw that in there just because, you know, sure. Alright. 
All right, look at that. It was enough. Ooh. Okay. So with that said, how are you doing, man? All right, seems to be working for us. So, that's kind of weird. There's no hitch on the back of this. How is it supposed to attach to these? Hmm. Those are for the D754. See, these are for that. You know, there's the tippet trailer, liquid trailer. See, there's these four trailers for it. Um, but I think there was, if I remember rightly, two different versions of this truck. No, it's exactly the same. Presets, that just changes a bunch of stuff. Wheel brands, setup, front grills, vinyls, extras. Side, yeah, that's just stuff on there. Hmm, I don't get it. See, this is the one we have, and as far as I know, it's only the actual horsepower that varies. Nope. And D754. Oh. Oh. Okay, then. I see what I have done. Bye. So. That explains it. What we, in fact, need are... Uh, this guy... And I guess it's this, yeah, this guy. All right, good thing they're inexpensive, I mean, you know. So, we got this guy, a capacity, 6,000, 8,000 liters. That's only another 2K, hey? Let's buy that. And we need the water as well. multi-product tank. Yeah, that'll do. 5,000 liters. Eh, we don't have a choice with that, so we will buy it as is. Alright. Now, simple as a pimple, we've done this before. Go. I have a dump truck. Alright, let's go.
This thing should just fly because it's, well, it's a pickup truck. No, don't do that. Come on. What the heck, you were flying up to two seconds ago when I actually needed to use ya. So not quite enough weight on the back, eh? That's okay. We will need to uh, get a larger weight. I mean, I may, I'm not likely to ever need to pick up stone. But... We've also got uh, a bit of silage. Like 60-something thousand liters. That are gonna have to be moved this way. I suppose we could get belts and do it, but... I'd rather not. Okay. There. Boop. That should be it. Alright. Yeah. Is that full then? Apparently. Okay. Well, that's all right. The important part is, is to get it all up off the ground. Because it's, it's going to get dumped again immediately. Or as close to immediately here as we can manage. So let's get you out of the way. Nice. Oh, 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 oh. I know why it wouldn't take it. I have that uh, setting turned on that trailers will only take their fill limit by weight is basically what it is. So, I mean, if it said, like, this is supposed to have an 8,000 liter capacity, but it also only carries X number of tons of weight. So, rather than filling by volume, they're filling by weight, I guess would be the easiest way to explain it. You end up with trailers that carry less. So it's a really stupid decision on my part. <laughs> okay, let's go into our... Uh, <coughs> excuse me. Ever-friendly construction menu. Let's click go away. Yes. Now that one's only 10k. Unfortunately, the one we're buying is 25k. So, yeah. Now, we didn't lose any money on that one. It's just the price difference between them is $15,000. So, yeah. Uh, buildings, production. Here we are. This is the little guy here. Well, little guy. It's about the same size when you get right down to it.
Okay. Yeah, it's the same thing I did last time. And the rocks were sitting right here. They were gone completely. So now... Easy peasy, we just dump all the rocks in. And now they're actually of some use to us. Other than, like I said, the 25 bucks they would have given them to us for, you know, as rocks. And there we go. And this guy. Not a great way to look out the back, I'm afraid. Okay. Dump the stones. So let's see here. Does this thing have a push start or something? There we go. 4,682 somethings. Okay. Uh, lime, yes, lime. Lime activate. Oh, it needs water as well. Oh. Oh. Okay then. Well, you sure showed me, didn't you? Oh no! And... Perfect line. Alright, so, note to self. Don't do stupid things. Alright, here we go. Oh, of course it's not just filling up. Why? That's not what I want. This is uh, unload. Un oh, unfold. Uh oh. Open cover. Start filling. Oh, okay. There's a process. I did not realize this. That's okay, we can feed our greenhouses now as well. This costs money? What? Why does water cost money? Oh man, that ain't cheap water either, is it? Oh.
Well, so much for turning our five hundred dollars. So much for turning our. Uh, Close those. What did it unfold anyway? Really? Well, it's hardly flammable. It's water. I guess it can be used for uh, refueling as well. Alright, let's see how we do. Yeah, I don't think a whole lot of time was spent on the uh, handling physics on this. Alright, so where would one dump a water? Hmm? cover maybe <laughs> it is unfolding Yeah, and then the I key does nothing. All right. Um, See, it's still at stop overloading. Nope. Yeah, it won't even close the covers. Oh, another freaking broken mod, is it? Guess I should have known better. Well, let's see if we can get the water out of the greenhouses. Same thing. Yeah, and nothing. Oh. So there you go. I wouldn't advise you uh, pick up this particular mod again. It was on the mod hub, but yeah. Now I tried the greenhouses just to see if maybe it was the. Uh, little factory thing that wasn't working. Doesn't seem to be the case. So... Well, $500 worth of water plus whatever we lose on selling these. Getting pretty tired of that, too. Oh, 
this isn't the stuff we own, sorry. I mean, we know this works, but yeah, no, not worth it. Didn't we pay 3500 for it? Huh. Sure. Okay. Unfortunately, that means that we are going to need to just buy uh, a water tank. So we get this guy, it's eight grand. It holds 6,000 liters of water and water only. This is the one that comes with it. It'll do, it won't do water. <laughs> of course not. Um, it does milk and I guess that's methane or whatever, although methane I think is a gas, so... Um, 7,300 liters, yeah. Well, this guy holds all of it. 25,000. I don't mind the price, the problem is it's the goofing axle. Well, I think I have that mod that locks these. So. And in the long run, it is cheaper than the uh, other things. Combined, although we don't get the tipper, but oh well. That's just gonna have to uh, be what it is. Um, no. You're done, are you? Okay, well, that's good news. Let's fold that up. Uh, did anything else need rolled? I don't think so. Yeah, I didn't quite judge that one correctly. There we go. Cool. Alright, let's go get our new water tank. Now we'll get to uh, buy more water. <laughs> Why not? Something tank, anyway. Like, I mean, the model is really well done. But, as I say, it is going to be a uh, bit of a mooker. Is that something that comes up under here? Toggle guidance steer. Oh, block trailer. Okay, yeah. Awesome. So you just hit. I think that's Y. Might be V. Hang on. Why? Just hit Y. Okay. Why? Because we... Never mind, stupid musketeers, anyway. Okay, let's get up here. Well, let's see, we're running considerably over time here. Even your money's worth out of me today, I'll tell you. <laughs> Speaking of money's worth, there is a uh, 
link to my Patreon channel down below. If anyone would care to contribute in such a fantastic way. And of course, a big thanks to those that do. A very, very big thanks to those that do. Look at that. Feels like, like, issueless. Absolutely. So, we'll try that block thing to get out of here. I guess it does just that. It puts a block in the mechanism so that it won't the swivel at that particular point. I wonder what... Well, it probably locks it square. You know? At least I'm hoping it would. Otherwise, you'd have to be awfully careful when you put it into lock. Or you'd just end up driving in circles, wouldn't you? Mm-hmm. More thousands of dollars on water. I suppose that's a thing in places. I'm just not used to it because, well, everywhere I've lived my entire life, water has been free. So, I still appreciate it, but it's been free. That was uh, $800. <laughs> ah. So there we are. We've spent uh, $1,300 on water in the last five minutes. All right, let's try this lock thing. Okay. Okay, it says it's locked. Ooh, look at that. Ha, I can back it up. Oh, that's just a brilliant thing. It's a little weird because it is backing up from a pivot point further back than we're sort of used to with trailers. But, oh, that was just genuinely easy. There we are, unlocked. Oops. And, uh... Wither hither and saw it, away we go. Of course, some idiot left a tractor parked right in the middle of the driveway. <laughs> I don't know what he was thinking. Or not, as the case may be. Alright, go back to the lock. Yoing. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Yes, where have you been all my life? I can use twice as many trailers now as I used to. Water. Now, is this going to work, or did I sell a bunch of stuff that worked? No, look at that. Right away. Are you going to take all my water? You are, aren't you? You're not going to leave me any for my greenhouses. Man... Okay, let's make sure this is running. Because as we saw, we do chew through the lime, man. So there we are, lime. Water. Perfect. Activate. So it takes 2,000 liters of stone and 1,200 liters of water to make 4,500 liters. So we should get about 10,000 liters of lime. And there you go, guys. I'm going to end the episode there. Like I say, we are actually uh, over by quite a bit. No, you know what? We're going to move you first. So. If you enjoyed the episode, please remember to hit that like button. If you have issues with it, well, hit the don't like button. And leave a comment down below telling me just what an absolute twat I am. Till next time, have yourselves a great day. Take care of each other, folks. And ciao for now.